Hey, hey, Michelle here from Sensate Soul. <laughs> I told you I was gonna start singing the introduction. Um, <laughs> so I'm Michelle and I help with sensitivity and empowerment in life and business uh, for women, women going through change, as well as um, specialize with HSPs and empaths and what I lovingly call us empreneurs to be able to play on our strengths play with our strengths, <laughs> have a lot more fun being an HSP um, in our lives and also in our businesses. Um, so <clears throat> today I want to talk about briefly here EFT and um, what I don't really let a lot of people know about this um, publicly, but I'm going to start doing that more because it's been a real focus uh, and core part of the work that I've done for a long time is um, <clears throat> working with EFT with my clients and with groups. And um, I wanted to give a couple tips why EFT is super powerful, uh, why it really is um, extra effective for shifting mindsets and particularly also if you call yourself one who is more sensitive, um, my God, how is it, how can you not be sensitive in the world lately, the way things are? Um, you know, with all the changes and all of the potential shifts as well as all of the intensity. Um, but of course, there are those of us in the world who are um, on the neurodiversity spectrum of being highly sensitive, uh, which means you are a, um, highly sensitive is actually a term that's within the umbrella of, uh, it's called SPS, sensory processing sensitivity. Um, and so anyway, you can find out more about that. I've got a bunch of really big blogs <laughs> that describe and um, make distinguishes on all the different types of HSPs on my blog at sensatesoul.com. So you can check that out there. Um, <clears throat> so I want to speak briefly about EFT. Uh, I also do have a course uh, at Sensate Soul that will be coming out in a little bit uh, that can help you learn Sensate, uh, help you learn EFT um, and it's you know on all different levels if you want to do it you know um, quickly or if you want to do it discreetly um, and also goes into some of the science um, around the meridians and the pressure points that we're actually working on so it's uh, it's a really choose what you want to learn whether it's the um, surface level or whether it's a deep dive. So uh, so I started using EFT actually in the late 90s um, when it first started coming out because I happened to also be in graduate school for clinical psychology at the time. So I started hearing more about these energy psychologies and um, positive psychology was just starting to get going as well. Martin Seligman was the um, president of the American Psychological Association at the time. So things were really shifting and thank goodness that they have. Um, and now we have all of these different, um, and we'll continue to have more and more um, practices that include uh, body sensation and of course, mind-body healing. So I am a certified practitioner of both TFT and EFT. And oh my God, I'm just gonna say this here because I really, really want to uh, just let it out into the universe um, that so I stopped seeing, I know I'm kind of saying a lot of different things here, but it'll all come together. If you've seen any of my videos, you know it comes together at the end or in the middle, sometimes in the beginning. So I stopped seeing private clients in December of 2018 because there had some different shifts that are going on in my work and also in my personal life and, um, you know, all really good reasons, but it's just, you know, natural evolution. And um, I love focusing, working with groups and uh, my students in that way and I'm really excited because I'm doing some envisioning for and planning for 2020 and I'm going to be doing a training with a uh, very well-known hypnotherapist and I'm going to start um, at some point next year offering the type of therapy 
Now I'm just gonna say it. I'm gonna be trained to do the rapid transformational therapy with Marissa Peer, um, and that is gonna be my only one-to-one -one type of work um, that I'm gonna be offering next year. So really excited about that. Not only excited about that, but there's a good chance that my son is gonna get trained as well. Uh, he'll be 17 at the time, and we're gonna be doing some traveling, and that's gonna be one of the reasons why we will be in the UK to travel because he's getting really into psychology and uh, really into different ways to be able to work with um, people on deeper levels, particularly with his very, uh, I'm just adding all this because I just love my son so much, uh, obviously, but um, so he's got a very beautiful, uh, there's something about the frequency of his voice that he will be um, using probably in his vocations in his life um, in some creative and therapeutic way so anyway EFT get back to it um, EFT is a brilliant modality because for these three reasons and there's many more but I want to give you these three so that you'll consider getting some EFT working with a practitioner because it's always more powerful when you are working with somebody else um, but if you can't do that uh, don't want to do that can't afford to do that it is an absolutely amazing self-healing technique and that's the first one is that it is free you can do it yourself you can learn easily or you can go you know like the class that um, the course that I'm going to be t offering very soon that you can go in more depth with it but you have it literally at your fingertips anytime that you want to do some self-healing and work through some emotions some energy some mindsets it is there for your taking if you so choose to use it so that's point number one it is free and available anytime number two here is that it includes your nervous system which is one of those things that in energy psychology you know there there is and I used to be a therapist so uh, there's nothing wrong with talk therapy it is amazing you know we need to hear our stories uh, and they need to be witnessed and spoken through but at a certain point you know this it really do, it can be a disconnect from the body um, and the mind and that's actually one reason why I left psychology was because I was feeling I had been a therapist um, massage therapist before and did a lot of energy works and different things like that and I was just feeling like you know that was one of the reasons it's like I needed to have more hands-on so I started going into um, psyche and different um, quantum field type of work um, that included some physical contact and um, doing more EFT as well so it includes your body to create that body-mind connection and most particularly it works with those energy points on the meridians to help mellow out your nervous system to help tell your body through the gentle tapping um, that it's kind of like literally hey it's gonna be all right it's gonna be okay I'm paying attention to you I'm here for you <laughs> so that's really a very powerful piece of why EFT is so effective that it is deeply acknowledging it is deeply accepting so when you do EFT the point of it really is to have self-empathy that is the, the heart of EFT is to be able to not only emotionally uh, and mentally be able to speak on your self empathy and your self acceptance but you're also physically you know affirming that into your nervous system so it's a, it is a beautiful physical empathy practice that uh, again you know connecting into that second point about you know how it works with your nervous system um, it's you get to talk nicely to yourself and there is the other side of that, um, which of course is, I add this to one of the points in the EFT course about how it gets that external critic out of you. So, you know, you get to air out that inner critic. So that's a fourth point. So we'll just add that because it's on the other side of being um, really, you know, talking to yourself kindly. And we all need to have more of that inner coach, that inner cheerleader, that uh, part of us that is kinder that is more empathetic with ourselves that really is more accepting and the one who can cheer you on you know because so often the inner critic voice is uh, that we all have and all hear 
you know, it can just be ruthless. So to be able to really speak kindly to yourself is another really important part about why EFT it can be so effective. All right, thanks so much for watching this video. And um, if you like it, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, share with a friend if you so choose. And as well, come on over to Sensate Soul and also look for, in Sensate Soul School for that EFT course if you are interested in taking that to deepen your knowledge or to learn. You can take it at any level if you're uh, a newbie or if you're somebody who's been doing it for a while and is looking for more information or more um, depth in your practice. And also join my community list over there so we can stay in touch through private emails and things and offers that I only share through our private communications. All right, take sweet, sweet care. Talk to you soon and enjoy your incredible, sensitive, empowered self. All right, bye-bye for now.